Can a guy catch a break? What? Can a guy catch a break? This one's working for the Green Lanterns. Get them! Get them! Ah. 
They're aiding the Sinestro Corps. Arrest them! with you until I'm at 100%. I can take this one, even with a screwy ring. This is insanity. The Sinestro Corps' yellow powers draw on the power of fear, much like the Green Lantern rings draw on willpower. They're not friendly guys. And it looks like they're all zeroing in on City Hall. I'm updating your map. Any attempt to discuss the situation with Sinestro has failed. Against all the evidence, he's convinced the Green Lanterns are sabotaging his core's rings. Since he wants a fight, give it to him. The sooner we drain the charge from those yellow rings, the better. By Superman, the Sinestro Corps is using an amplifier device to boost their rings against interference. You must disable the device. The Green Lanterns are no match for our Sinestro Corps, no matter how you weaken our rings.
I find the lanterns responsible for this, I will send those fools into an inescapable horror! It's happening to all of us. Sabotage. Watching the ring's energy signatures, it looks like something is blocking their usual power source, like it's trying to rewrite all of them somehow. Both Sinestro and Green Lantern Corps. But what? Sinestro's getting desperate. His core is capturing Green Lantern rings to weaken the Green Lantern Corps. Free the rings. Even if the core can't use them, at least we'll get them out of Sinestro's hands. Ring status report. Sinestro Corps member 482 deceased. Sector scan 48. Due to the malfunction in our rings, we require your aid. Find a fallen manhunter. We will have a processor unit to remove the rings of fallen yellow lanterns. Lock these rings inside our green prison constructs before they find Ring status report. Sinestro Corps member 1107 deceased. Sector scan 1107. Placement sentient initiated. Last survivor of the planet, Molorax Vic. Wanted dead or alive on the count of eating and letting the green light of the core. Ring status report. Ring status report. Sinestro core member. Sinestro core member. 541. Sector scan 541. Sector scan 541 for replacement sentient in Ring status report. Ring status report. Sinestro Corps member. Ring status report. Sinestro Corps member 541 deceased. Sector scan 541 for replacement sentient initiated. Ring status report. Sinestro Corps member 1107 deceased. Sector scan 1107 for replacement sentient initiated. Keep the Sinestro Corps away from the. Oh. Ring status report. 
Sinestro Cool Member 482 deceased. Sector scan. Ring status report. Sinestro Core Member 541 deceased. Sector scan 541. Status report. Sinestro Core Member 482 deceased. Sector scan for ring status report. Sinestro Core Member 1107 deceased. Ring status report. Sinestro Core Member 1107 deceased. Sector scan 1107 for replacement sentient. Ring status report. Sinestro status core member report. four a Sinestro core member. Sinestro core member Sinestro core member one one zero Ring status report. Ring status report. Ring status report. Sinestro core member five four one. Sector scan ring status report. Status report. Green Lantern 1512 deceased. Space sector scan 1512. Ring status report. Green Soon as I find the Poojas are messed up, Ring I'm status going report. I'm gonna pound their head right through the back of yesterday. Ring status report. Green Lantern 1512. Space Sector Scan 1512. Ring Status Report. Status report. Green Lantern 804 deceased. Space sector scan 804. Oh boy. I'm tracking a huge yellow light construct at City Hall. It looks like a giant fear generator. I'm alerting John Stewart. He'll meet you inside with the core. Sinestro has created a yellow fear generator construct to boost all of his malfunctioning rings. John Stewart and Select Core will meet you inside to help take it out. Maybe then Sinestro will listen to reason, and we can locate the source of the real disturbance. Maybe. But I doubt it. 
Status report. Keep those constructs Sinestro Corps up. member 541 deceased. Sector scan 541 for replacement sentient initiated. Bring status report. Sinestro Corps member 1107 deceased. Sector scan 1107 for replacement sentient initiated. One of the good guys. The Sinestro Corps is using remote fear generators made from man to boost their powers. Are you here to fight? Good. One of Sinestro's manhunters is just behind this door. He's been slightly damaged, so that may give us an advantage. Bring down the shield! We're heading in! In brightest day, in blackest night, no evil shall escape my sight. Let those who worship evil's might beware my power! Green Lantern's light! Steward, man on your bounty. Aptitude for technology, and able to create elaborate light constructs. Wanted dead or alive on counts of aiding and abetting the Green Lantern Corps. Sinestro's might. I see through Sinestro's power. You fear what's right. But you cannot stop the Sinestro Corps, and you will pay for this attempt to limit our power. You're crazy if you think the ring malfunctions have anything to do with us, Sinestro. But then, reason was never your strong point. You want to fight, you got one.
it. Your fear only makes us stronger. Don't need to let evil escape my sight. It's right here in front of me. Thanks for the assist. With our rings acting up, we can use it. That last assault should have drained Sinestro's rings near zero. Maybe now the Lanterns can finally track the source of the original disturbance. You did Metropolis proud, and the Green Lantern Corps as well. Sinestro won't get far. I was the greatest of the Green Lanterns. I brought law and order in the universe. Forcing my will upon the light, I brought a new dawn to the Lantern Corps. When I was banished, I found willpower is easily broken. By fear. Fear is strong. You think you are fearless, but I am so easily defeated. Let those who try to stop what's right burn like my power, Sinestro's might! On behalf of the core, accept my thanks. Strangely, even with the fear generator destroyed, our rings are still erratic. We may need to call upon you again.
Hey, I promised Gordon I'd babysit these two before they're taken to Arkham, or I'd join you out on the streets. The Joker's clowns are acting even crazier than usual because of the Joker's new toxin. That stuff is like atomized insanity. Good luck out there. This is Batman. The Joker's clowns have no respect for human life, and today is no exception. When this attack began, I received an obscure encoded signal. That can't be a coincidence. I need you to clean up the Joker's mess while I decrypt the code. Joker, 
There's no sense in any of this. <laughs> Good work. Whatever's happening here is a part of a bigger plan. I've decoded the signal that began at the start of the attack, and it's a series of coordinates. I'm uploading the first one to your map now. Hey! Stay away! This is gonna get me on TV! All of Gotham sees this sword. Riddler is back in action? Last I heard, he'd retired from a life of crime and started his own detective agency. But from these clues, he's slipping into his old criminal lifestyle. Huh. I wonder why. The Riddler's bizarre fixation with riddles prevents him from saying anything directly. When is an attack not an attack? When it's a feint. He's saying the Joker's attack here is just a diversion. But from what? There's a second set of coordinates. I'm sending them to your map now. These coordinates led us directly to another clown attack. The Riddler must want us to shut the Joker down. But why? Whatever his reason, take advantage of it. Take out the clowns and then get to Nigma's next clue. Yeah, you know, I almost had him before he threw the gas grenade at me. No, really, I... Never mind. Thanks. Those freaking clowns. Uh, yeah, you know, I need a drink. Look who joined the party! Those freaky clowns! I need a drink. Says, ah! you Riddler here! Please. I see you've stopped to find my go. Oh, what a what classic is? game of luck! Uh, yeah. You know, I almost had it. I'll oh, stop! Oh, keep laughing up! Bandex! <laughs> uh, yeah. You know, I almost had him before you... Look who joined the party! <laughs> Those freaky clowns! I need a drink. Ugh. You know, I almost had him before he threw the gas grenade at me. Please, you've got to help. Those freaky clowns. Laugh it up! I need a drink. Super tight tier one to play! Joker thinks he is king, but he is a tool? It sounds like the Riddler is saying someone is jerking the Joker's strings. But who'd be crazy enough to do that? Nigma's second riddle. It must mean that the Joker is working with someone to make his toxin. Someone who's using the Joker for his own ends.
I'm putting the third coordinates on your map. Let's see what the Riddler's next clue reveals. Hello, I work for Wayne Tech. I've been assigned to the <laughs> Tights! Incoming! Don't let them break the fun van! Get in close. Those robots, they're models of Red Tornado, the robot created by T.O. Morrow. You'll know tomorrow. Very clever, Riddler. The previous attacks were all designed to draw attention away from the Joker's new robot squad. You know what to do. One must apologize for targets. Imminent termination. J one in one you now hold requires J one in one power core if you would like to know more about the J one in one You don't have to be alive for me to test the dots, you know. Receiving new directives. New directives. Annihilate the annoying fast vehicle as belonging to Master Joker. You're gonna die laughing. Please refer to page 42 of the
next week. This is Riddler. Ah, the Towers of Hanoi. In order to understand the Towers, you must... understand the Towers. Please, you've got to help! 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 You've got to stop them! One in, one receiving new directive. New directive. Annihilate annoying costume three. You now hold the J one in one. You're gonna die. All right, I give. I know... It doesn't take Batman to decode that last clue. Riddler's in trouble at the Monarch Trading Card Company. Updating your map. The Riddler's compulsion to flaunt his knowledge in riddles has helped us, but condemned him. The Joker will kill him for exposing his J1N1 robot attacks. With luck, you can get to the Riddler before Joker's killers do. It's the only chance the Riddler's got. Hello, Batman. When is a door not a door? When it's a jar. The door to what I know is definitely a jar, Batman. If you can find it later, we're at ease. I'm sorry. That response is not... Who is this? You're not Batman, but clearly working with Batman, or you never would have found me. Very well. 
Solve my riddles and you will find me and my message for the Dark Knight. This. Want to get past my locks? Start to think outside the box. What I'm trying to convey will belt you. A license technician? Say yes. Riddler here. The Soma Cube is akin to an elegant philosophy, but I'm sure someone of your mental capacity is nicely done. Very good. Three sons, seeking fortune, made their way along the road one bright fine day. They came at last to a triforked road and each a different route now strode. The middle son, the left path tread, with dreams of riches in his head. The youngest took the middle pass, a wife he hoped to find at last. The eldest the right road did claim, a fine estate was his good aim. The roads did wind and twist and bend, but each path seemed a strange dead end. To dodge this fate, so say the sages, order not their paths, but in Apologies for my overly protective bodyguards. I had, of course, already determined that you aren't Joker's assassin. Your time's up, Nigma. I never fail a contract. It's Deathstroke! You have to protect me from him! I'll tell you everything! Just don't let him kill me! I'll kill you for free. Deathstroke. I'd have thought the man famed to use 90% of his brain would have figured it out already. Joker's play- I never fail a contract. I see. The Joker's transfer was denied for insufficient funds. Well, there you are. No money, no contract, no funeral for you, Riddler. Riddler here. This puzzle box, when correctly put together, reveals an internal secret. After that, 
Maybe I don't mind Batman not showing after all. Tell Batman, T. O'Mara was working with the Joker, but he's gone rogue. That toxin is far more dangerous than anything the Joker's used before. And T. O'Mara has the real formula. Now. Riddles. Enigmas wrapped in conundrums. And with Moro gambling with the Joker, all bets are off. Because what kind of hand do a Joker and an Ace make? A dead man's hand. Or try this one. The man who makes it doesn't want it. The man who wants it doesn't use it. The man who uses it will never know he has it. Give up. A coffin. Riddle me this. Can anyone win this war? The only thing that could ever get Deathstroke to back off a hit is lack of funds. It's a point of honor. I'd say the Joker just made a serious enemy. And that if the Riddler's really as smart as he thinks he is, he'll take Echo and Query and stay hidden for a while. Now that we know the Joker... Now that we know the Joker is working with T.O. Morrow, we can start making plans to take them both down. The new Joker toxin is far too dangerous to leave in their hands, not to mention Morrow's Jokerized robots. Thank you for your help today. Speak to Nightwing in the safe house. Batman out. Riddler here. I'm no fan of the night, but I do enjoy controlling the pawns. Run for your life! Oh, yeah.
So you made it out alive against Deathstroke. You're one tough customer. And that's good, because with T.O. Morrow working with the Joker, we're gonna need every hero we've got. This is Oracle. The international crime organization Intergang has created a new religion based on their so-called crime bible. We need to shut down their operations before their cult spreads across Gotham. The question in Gotham's Diamond District Police Station has more intel. This is Oracle. The international crime organization Intergang has created a new religion based on their so-called crime bible. We need to shut down their operations before their cult spreads across Gotham. The question in Gotham's Diamond District Police Station has more intel. Batwoman and I are working to keep tabs on Intergang's religion of crime. We can use your help, but get ready. These Intergang believers are more than just muscle. They truly believe. I'm tracking intergang activity now. Looks like one of their main bosses has a safe house nearby. I'm putting it up on your map. I'm coming. What are you, stupid? Don't you know who we are? The Book of Blood, Chapter 8, Verse 23. By deceit ye have freed yourself from the illusion of truth, and thus do I name the first lesson of blood.
No one interferes with inner gang and lives. It is written. Get him, boys. Take them out. will drown in blood before a weakling unbeliever like you makes me talk. Wait, wait! Just in case the prophecy isn't true, I'll tell you. Mannheim says the crime bible promises infinite power once he kills the twice-named daughter of Cain. He's doing it tonight. That's all I know! has a lead on a nearby intergang warehouse. Meet up with her on site. If Mannheim is planning to murder someone, we've got to get there now. I'll try to contact Batwoman in the question so you can join forces. I knew I smelled someone in here. I commit your soul to Cain. Take them out. Chapter 40, verse 37. Lilith raised him up, and setting his hands upon her, spoke with breath hot on his neck. What ye name virtue, I call weakness. For ye lust heartily, but have not strength nor courage enough to slake it. Quick, turn off the security camera before Intergang knows you're here. I'm showing a terminal nearby. is sprung. Rejoice, my shapeshifters. The prophecy is fulfilled. The twice-named daughter of Cain, Batwoman, will die as the crime Bible foretells. Ah, look, Kyle. 
Another sheep to the slaughter. So you think to stop the prophecy? My shapeshifters will feast well tonight. Must I do everything myself? The Book of Blood, Chapter 19, Verse 12. This was all just a ruse to capture Batwoman for Intergang's ritual. I'm activating her tracking device. Follow the trail. The question is on her way. She'll meet you... Batwoman's tracker is at this location. Mannheim's planning to sacrifice her to fulfill the Crime Bible's prophecy. Get there and rescue Batwoman. We'll, we'll eat your heart for Mannheim! So that ye might learn truths that are hidden, that ye might pull secrets hidden in the very heart that hides. And so see my kingdom rise anew upon the earth in Cain's name.
saith the crime bible. Let the razor cut quick and right in Cain's name. We commend the heart of this wayward daughter. May the fires of pain and rage blaze on earth. In Cain's name! Batwoman, I promise we'll get you out of here. The infidels dare to interrupt the right? Eviscerate them! Your blood will stain the red rock! Your brains will run red! You have not stopped the prophecy of crime! All is written in the vile book! Take the book. Hang in there, Batwoman. We'll get you to a doctor. The religion of crime is targeting me. I need to know why. And the Crime Bible has the answers. The Book of Blood, chapter... That woman is safe, and we have the Crime Bible. Whatever this prophecy may be, we need to make sure it never comes to pass. I'll keep you posted. Oracle out. Thanks for your assist against Center Gang's insane cult. We're going to take a careful look at this crime bible. Who knows what other prophecies it might contain. This is Oracle. The Atlanteans are swarming in from the sea into suicide slums and taking humans prisoner. I'm trying to contact Aquaman, but we can't wait. Speak to Martian Manhunter at the Chinatown safe house. He has on-the-spot information. I spoke to Aquaman only recently. He misses his wife, Queen Mira, but he did not mention the
help prevent a mighty war. Welcome, warrior. We will need your skills in this fight. The Atlanteans are invading and turning innocents into water-breathing slaves. We must find Aquaman and end this unjustified attack. Until then, act with force. Push them back and free the enslaved humans. Kneel before your betters, pathetic Rylander. You will serve King Arthur and Queen Mira. Atlanteans shall rule all the earth. Seize the Drylander. Atlanteans shall rule all the earth. Seize the Drylander!
Aquaman was a hero. I was afraid I'd be their slave forever. Seize the Drylander. Stand down and you. You won't invade Metropolis on my watch. The Atlanteans are an ancient magical civilization, and they've always sneered at us dry landers, but they've never invaded before. The and the dark world chain to Atlantis was severed, burying the city beneath the waves. The Atlanteans are teleporting via magical tide pools further into suicide slums. Shut down their reinforcements and restore their kidnapped victims before the tide takes them all. Slave. Blonde hair and blue eyes. By these signs will you know the spawn of Cordax. Telepath. Sea creature commander you will all and be revolutionary. Soon. No! You see you destroyed, Drylander! Seize the Drylander! Aquaman at all. He's the king of Atlantis. He must be able to stop this. Sure, he and Queen Mira lead a race of proud Atlanteans, but invading Metropolis seems a bit drastic.
This unprovoked attack must be stopped. Aquaman will not answer my hails. I fear the worst. He would never condone this invasion. This is Vicki Vale with a special JLA watch on the Justice League's Martian Manhunter. The sole survivor of the Martian race, the Manhunter is a powerful telepath and a gentle shapeshifter. And with those shifting skills, you never know. The person next to you could just be the Martian Manhunter. Beware always the seal men of the Bitterlands beneath the South Pole. Atlanteans shall rule oh, all the earth. The next stage is almost complete, sir. You will all be slaves soon. Long have the Atlanteans made use of power crystals in their magics. Manhunter deciphered some Atlantean thoughts before they shut him out. They say Queen Mira is causing this war, and Aquaman is her devoted slave. Slave, huh? Anyone else find that suspicious? I sense Circe's cruel lies in this endeavor. You must stop this invasion where it begins. Martian Manhunter will meet you below the abandoned shipyards. Perhaps together you can break through to Aquaman and restore him to reason.
And though the seas have tempest-tossed Queen Mera Those and our king, stones carry always their limit. love stayed true. They I cannot scan these Atlantean mines, but I can disguise us both so we can move freely among them. I will scout ahead. You speak to them and find out their plans. The Tidestone node is strong! It pours our power over the land! The Tide's ritual will ensure our success. With our Tide ritual, the Tides will soon overflow the land! Glory to Arthur, King of Atlantis! The Atlanteans are blocking my mental suggestions. So no more disguises. We'll just have to fight until we reach Aquaman. Aquaman and Mira are this way. There is something strange, though. Hello. I need to get closer. Sea Fury Arbs are, of course, the core munitions of the Atlantean army.
Aquaman and Mira are just ahead. I can only read their minds dimly through their magics. But I will tell you this, that woman is not Queen Mira. I cannot make out their thoughts. I must get closer. Follow me through the door. Arthur, please stop this madness. That is not Queen Mira. She lies. Enough! This war will continue until the atrocities the surface dwellers have wrought against my kingdom have been avenged. We must release Aquaman from this imposter's control, or his kingdom will savage the land. This is my realm, and you are not welcome here! You dare! I condemn you to a watery grave! What? What has happened? Where is Mera? Circe, what have you done with her, you witch? Your queen is here, great Arthur. But if you do not abdicate your throne to me, she shall never swim the waves again. No, in I her will... name I will smite you! Aquaman is free from my spell, but the victory is mine. The rift I have created between the Atlanteans and the surface world has weakened both your peoples. The damage is done. <laughs> Were it not for you, Triton knows what would have come of this deception. We must return to Atlantis at once, and tend to the damage Circe has caused among my people. Aquaman is freed from Circe's cruel lie. Now that Queen Mera is again at his side, the war between land and sea should end. Ruler of the vast ocean empire of Atlantis. But I am a king in exile, abandoned by my queen, rejected by my people for an alliance with the surface world. I will heal that breach and forge a peace between the land and the sea. No matter my joy or my despair, that is my destiny. For beneath the waves, I am king. But on land, they call me Aquaman. Circe has made a lifelong enemy of the Atlanteans with this ruse. Her attempts to enslave the world under magical tyranny become more desperate. Thanks to you, her lies were revealed, and Aquaman freed from her deceit. Martian Manhunter is waiting for you, with our thanks.
Aquaman is freed from Cersei's cruel lie. Now that Queen Mara is again at his side, the war between land and sea... So we've got a little undead situation at the University of Gotham. Felix Faust's magents are draining souls from students and zombies are overrunning the area. Talk to Shazam in the Diamond District Police Station so we can put these souls to rest. Hello. We must save Faust's victims and prevent Black Adam from making a terrible mistake. He believes Felix Faust can raise his wife, Isis, from the dead. But evil acts have evil results. We must stop this ritual. Wonder Woman here. My greetings. The foul necromancer Felix Faust is targeting innocents to steal their souls and power a ritual to bring Black Adam's wife, Isis, back from the grave. No good can come of this. We must save these people and stop Faust. Dissertation notes. Hoppy, the baboon-headed god of the north, seeks out the dead where they dwell in the afterlife.
feel my soul slipping away. The Soul Globe's power must be delivered to Kondash. It felt like my soul was being ripped from my body. <laughs> from my body. Like my soul is being ripped. You shall pay for this. You will never be. Faust is obsessed with gaining the flame of life. There's no way he'd resurrect Isis out of the good of his heart. He doesn't have one. He's up to something. Faust is channeling the power of his stolen souls through a portal to Kondok in the middle of campus at the archaeology building. Find the portal so we can stop this ritual before it's too late. Magic and Faust's barrier will let only his soulless through. We must disguise you. I will warn you, it will... Dissertation notes. The consent of Anubis is required for any travel from beyond the afterlife. The magic and Faust barrier will let only his soulless through. We must disguise you. I will warn you, it will not be pleasant. The university warehouse is stocked with Kondaki relics that may help. down there. They've already taken out a couple of supers. No way I'm opening these doors until those things are gone. Help me out. Joker's clowns held me up two weeks ago, made me stash them in those crazy boxes. Yes. of those things down there. They ain't too much for you, are they? Dissertation notes. Falcon-headed god of the West, Kaba Sainaweth, ensures the safety of the dead on their journey back from beyond.
door stays closed until you clear out the thing. There are a ton up here already. Dissertation notes. The god of the sky, Horus, has the authority to return a soul from beyond death. Faust minions swarm inside. You must collect their ichor. Combine with the effects from those Kandaki artifacts. This should temporarily loosen your soul just long enough to do what must be done. Separating you from your soul is the only way to take out the deathless... Faust minions swarm inside. 
You must collect their ichor. Combined with the effects from those Kandaki artifacts, this should temporarily loosen your soul just long enough to do what must be done. You will need to leave your soul with the demon Etrigan. He waits for you near Faust's deathless obelisks. He wants Faust to gain power no more than we do. A test with my lasso has proved he will keep your soul safe. Hail, mortal, born of man! I am the demon Etrigan. You must destroy those cursed towers with your mighty undead. Wow, don't you look totally decomposed. You'll blend right in. For Faust to raise Isis, he'll be surrounded by Solus powering the flame of life. The bones of Isis lie this lie this lie this lie this lie this lie this lie in a tomb deep below. Black Adam and Faust have begun the ritual to give her life. We must move quickly.
Everything is in place. Stand back, Black Adam, and watch your love return to our world. Faust! What trickery is this? She does not live! Her flesh, it's rotting! Give her more of your powers! Do not hold back! Growing... so... weak! <laughs> the powers of Shazam are mine! Poor, pitiful Black Adam! Now merely Death Adam! Forever! Faust! What have you done?! These vines will hold you close to me, dearest Adam. Awaken Kandak Undead! And attack! Fair warning. Really good. We'll both pay for what you have done! I am an evil man. My rage has leveled cities, devastated friend and foe alike. But when Isis came into my life, everything changed. She was goodness, love. Hope. She made Kandak blue. Dissertation notes. Despite his evil actions, I pity Black Adam's grief for the woman he loved. May Aphrodite grant him peace from heartache. As for you, you have triumphed over the tyranny of death and revealed Faust's treacherous lies. You have served justice today, my friend. Dissertation notes. The jackal-headed god of the east, Duwamutef, escorts the dead to heaven.
Congratulations. You stopped Faust from stealing the power of Shazam. And Black Adam has lost Isis once again. I hope he learns from this and does not take revenge. I've got an urgent call from Fire in the East End Police Station. She spotted Omax cyborgs in Gotham and is calling in for backup. Batman is already on the alert. Talk to Fire and she'll contact you when you're on site. You know about the OMAC virus? It infects regular people and turns them into cyborgs. Cyborgs who want to kill anyone with superpowers or skills. Anyone. Superman, Batman, me, you, all of us. We have to stop the OMACs before they spread! This is Batman. The OMAC virus is a deadly threat, but there is more. The virus was unleashed by my own creation, the Brother MKI satellite. Now rogue, it calls itself Brother I. I believed it to be deactivated and destroyed. I must find why and how it has sprung to life. For now, I... Data 0728. A satellite with almost and communication capabilities. This is Batman. The OMAC virus is a deadly threat, but there is more. The virus was unleashed by my own creation. The Brother MKI satellite. Now rogue, it calls itself Brother I. I believed it to be deactivated and destroyed. I must find why and how it has sprung to life. For now, 
I need you to destroy its spy drones and help any citizens it may be targeting. Superhuman engaged. Please help me. Please, you've got to help. Threshold. I need to take a threat. I need your help. Please. I'm initiating defense sequences. Detecting unauthorized access to Brother I's location. Initializing weakness detection. I'm superhuman engaged. did create the Brother Eyes satellite, but he also destroyed it when it went crazy and decided every superhuman needed to die. For it to somehow reactivate itself is a very bad sign. This is Batman. The Omax are attacking heroes and villains gathered at Nightstone. Don't worry about the villains for now. You'll need every last hand. The Omax are armed with superpowers of their own, and they will quickly adapt to your attacks. Just remember, there are people inside those shells that we may be able to save. Good luck.
system is so weird. Even the villains are out there taking out the Omax. You know the situation has to be bad. Only an electromagnetic pulse can drive the Omax nanovirus out of its human host. He's airdropped into the area. Activate those against the Omax, then mark the survivors for quarantine. They'll need time and help to recover from Brother Eye's attack. Warm me up. <laughs> Initiating Shred Protocol. Data 0825. OMAC Directive 1. Monitor and control no metahuman activity. OMAC Directive 2. Ensure continued existence of Brother Eye Satellite. Thanks for freeing me from that thing. You cannot stop us. You've got to stop them. Executive command of Flat Fire. Run! Run! Why do you resist? Ah! Defense system recovery. They turned me into a cyborg.
Do something! Rerouting security. I'm sending Gotham PD a connection to the survivors' locations. Wayne Tech may have something to aid the recovery process as well. We have no choice. We must take out Brother Eye. From an old data link to the satellite, it seems that part of it's hidden in Gotham's sewers, using the tunnels to send Omax out into the city. It's resisting all my efforts to shut it down. You'll need to go in and use multiple EMPs to break its enhanced shielding. Thank goodness. I need help, and I just can't go in any further. I was studying Killer Croc's atavistic symptoms on a real alligator, and my test subject uh, escaped. Can you bring him back? interfering with my communications. I won't be able to contact you much longer, but be aware. Ava 1019, Lord Maxwell, ally of and advocate for the and brother I, deceased. Shielding is interfering with my communications. I won't be able to contact you much longer, but be aware. Brother Eye's drones are scouting the area. Analyze their patterns and you may be able to get past without activating them. I have you now. Evaluating the threat. Intruder has not been eliminated. You have entered the presence of Brother I. Leave now, or security measures will be initiated. Thank you. 
completed. Eliminating data bleed. creation of the Brother Eye project out of concern that he could not adequately control the meta-powered members of the superhero community.
It's the hero who blinded brother I. I'm glad you survived. And so will others now, thanks to you. The Spectre has gone mad and is raising spirits of the angry dead in Midtown. You must speak to Dr. Fate immediately. He's waiting for you at the Midtown Metropolis Police Station. Need any merchandise to help with your everyday battle for freedom, truth, and justice? I'm selling the stuff you need to beat back the bad guys, buddy. Perhaps one of Star Lab's advanced equipment options can help you out. Perhaps one of Star Lab's advanced equipment options can help you out. We need all the aid we can gather. The Spectre, the spirit of God's vengeance, has launched an attack on downtown Metropolis. He has raised spirits of the vengeful dead to judge and execute humanity. Go and seek out Sentry Lita of the Sentinels of Magic, so we will start to heal this wound. Welcome to the battle. We need warriors of your caliber for this threat. The Spectre has the power of God's vengeance to judge guilty souls, but here he has lost all mercy. 
I fear Circe's foul touch has turned the Spectre completely mad. Bring peace to these spirits. Souls are vulnerable to all kinds of evil when separated from their bodies. You must imbue them with the spell of strength to resist evil. We need your help. The Spectre has raised these ghouls to judge humanity, and they think life itself is a crime. Destroy them and guide their astral victims back to their bodies. But beware the Reapers. We will need a special power to banish them. We need your help. The Spectre has raised these ghouls to judge humanity, and they think life itself is a crime. Destroy them and guide their astral victims back to their bodies. But beware the Reapers. We will need a special power to banish them. It's like waking up.
waking up. It's like waking up. It's like waking up. myself again. It's like waking up from a nightmare. Thank you. is supposed to judge individual souls. For him to be assigning spirits to pass sentence for him means something is badly wrong. No matter how many of these spirits we banish, the Reapers are creating more. The Sentinels believe we can use the spectral cores of these raging spirits to banish them. Lightkeeper Lee can tell you what they need. We need you to help trap enraged spirits. Their essence may help defeat Listen those to Reapers. hubris, mortal. Take it is the sound of dozens of mages lifting their voices to cast spells and then screaming as their lives are ended.
I hope the heroes kick your ass. <laughs> Running a spectral analysis, no pun intended, on these manifestations. They're weirdly shadowed. I wonder, with a clip so free. I'll get back to you. Now is the true test of the Sentinel's plan. The Reapers were created by the Spectre to raise up souls to judge the living, and they must be destroyed. But to do so, you must come halfway to soul death yourself. Do not let death defeat you. See Light Kipper Chandi Gupta and end this. Close your eyes, mortal, and see redemption. An enormous winged yellow beast rises up before you and cows to a booming voice. Now is the true test of the Sentinel's plan. The Reapers were created by the Spectre to raise up souls to judge the living, and they must be destroyed. But to do so, you must come halfway to soul death yourself. Do not let death defeat you. See Light Kipper Chandi Gupta and end this misguided punishment. I'm innocent. I've done nothing wrong.
has somehow severed the specter from his human host. That would explain why he's unleashing judgment like this. I'm calling in Green Lantern and others as backup. Green Lantern has a history with the specter. Now you must do the impossible. Return the spirit of God's vengeance to his link with humanity. Green Lantern. Now you must do the impossible. Return the spirit of God's vengeance to his link with humanity. Green Lantern and Green Arrow will join you to face him in the Metropolis courthouse he has taken for his own. Perhaps they can appeal to the Spectre's memories. Or, failing that, help you bring him down. Do not expect to see compassion, mortal. There is none left.
Oh no! Spirits behind you! Oh man, thank you. And I thought jury duty was bad. My wife must be frantic. I'll go meet up with her now. I'm glad you're here. The Spectre's in the next room, and the craziness is hitting the fan. The Spectre needs a human soul in order to judge humanity. Without it, you get... Well, you've seen it. And I should know, I was once his host myself. Prepare yourself, and let me know when you're ready to move. All right, let's go. This might be a one-way trip. Messing with the Hand of Vengeance is a good way to find yourself judged... and executed. Just like old times, huh, Green Arrow? That'll show him. Ready? Aim? Yeah, this is not right. There's got to be something forcibly ripping away the Spectre's humanity. I'll keep him busy while you two check the hallways and find out what's doing this. Satisfaction in a just sentence, one must be certain of their judgment.
Sins, mortal. Healing whispers around you. Sins Mercy. and transgression without understanding. Every day it is merely an excuse for the, the weak to escape judgment. No, I reject these foolish emotions. They have clouded my judgment for too long. Without my humanity, I am lost. I must have a human host. judge people enough. You're losing this one! Ah, uh, how Jordan. You will be my human host once again, and contain the power of vengeance. forever <laughs> it waits to claim you all you yourself will be judged eclipso judged and punished Eclipso has always wanted the Spectre's power since he had it himself and lost it. Well, he didn't get it today, thanks to you. The Spectre has been rejoined to humanity, so he may properly fulfill his role as an agent of divine judgment. 
We deprived Circe of a valuable weapon today in the battle for magical power. My thanks. You have rejoined Spectre to his humanity, and restored the balance. It seems you are... fated for greatness. Urgent! We need your help immediately. Brainiac has bottled the Daily Planet, with both Superman and Lex Luthor inside. We're trying to get a teleport link, but something's gone wrong. Since you broke out of Brainiac's ship, I'm betting you can penetrate that bottle before Brainiac goes into full lockdown. Supergirl is in the Watchtower. She'll give you the device that will allow me to communicate with you once you're inside the bottle. This is it, the Watchtower. We've retrofitted it a bit for all you new heroes. The Green Lantern John Stewart drew up the plans. He's an architect. Just follow your minimap and activate the consoles. I'll tell you about the place. If you're working with Superman, then the Meta Wing was designed for you. You'll be spending a lot of time here with other Meta heroes like the Flash and Power Girl. Check out the Vendor's console for specialized Meta Human Strength equipment. With your superpowers, You'll need gear that can take as much punishment as you do. Oh, thank goodness! It's you! I know you can save my cousin! The moment the Daily Planet was bottled, he went to save Lois, and now... No one knows where he is! Use this comm link to Oracle. It's the one we use when we go into deep space, and it should work anywhere. Please hurry. I'm so worried. The Justice League Watchtower was specially designed to help heroes meet and get the equipment they need. But it's an unwritten JLA rule that you must gain renown with factions before you can obtain their exclusive gear. Our goal is to create solidarity with the entire hero cause. Each wing in the Watchtower has its own bank. Wayne Enterprises, Queen Industries, and others all contribute to a fund that rewards heroic activity 
and provides this secure storage for your gear. This is Superman. Oracle, can you hear me? I'm trying to get everyone to the teleport site, but Lex Luthor is... What are you doing? You madman, no! You fool. You'll leave all these people trapped. What just happened? Okay, good news. We can get a teleporter working out of here. The bad news, where did Lex Luthor teleport Superman? Get to the teleport site so I can find out where he's gone. Systems damage. Thank you so much. I'm gonna hide and take you out. So much. I'm gonna hide until you all find some way to uncork this bottle. Systems damage. If you're here to help, you need to save Superman. Luther dragged him into a teleporter and they both disappeared. Jimmy and I were trying to find some place safe from Brainiac's drones when you arrived. And if you see Superman, tell him not to worry about us. We're survivors. You're closing in on the site. I'm reading residual energy. I can send you wherever Luther sent Superman, except, and this is probably not news, Brainiac's forces seem to really want to keep Teleport you here. signal block. Command complete. Next process. Scan for enemy units. Locating repair droids for emergency system maintenance. Initiating self deactivation for binary cleaning. Damage detected. Reactivation in five seconds. Binary cleaning complete. System reactivated. Right. Portal up was Superman's teleport location. Some kind of crazy security encoding on here. Get to Superman and get both of you safe.
Well, this is bad. This is the Hall of Doom. And I cannot lock onto any sort of coordinates thanks to calculator's coding. From that trail of fire, Superman is here. And it's up to you to get him out. Good luck. Calculator to Hall of Doom. Justice League incursion in the tech wing. Yes, they found us. And they were dumb enough to teleport in. Metallo, secure the area. Reallocate the security robots. And someone put these fires out. Oracle here. That reinforced bracer is a testament to the vicious fighting ring known as the Pit. Lois Lane dictating. Let's see. The rivalry of the century. Lex Luthor against our Man of Steel, Superman. But who is really the true savior of humanity? The powerful magnate, bent on domination no matter what the cost? Or Superman, the selfless alien who defends our planet as his own? I, ugh, too biased. Perry will never. Lois Lane at Daily Planet Live with breaking news. The entire Daily Planet staff is trapped here inside the Daily Planet building, which is being bottled for digitization by Brainiac. I'll continue transmission as long as I can. Something's happening. Brainiac robots are teleporting in. Jimmy, forget the shot. Get down. What's the hurry, hero? You're just gonna die here anyway. I got my motor revving, and I'm ready to rumble! to come all alone. But that won't save you from me. I've slashed Wonder Woman with these claws. here. If it weren't completely inaccessible right now, that digital key code could have accessed the command center. I am Jack Ryder, and you are wrong. 
Why? Because Brainiac isn't just bottling up our cities. He isn't just trying to get the Exobite powers of future Luthor bombed into our world. No, he has a plan. Look where his bottles and Brainiac attack. And if you don't believe it, friend, then you... calibrated to detect exobytes in living subjects. Figures. Luther, this is Agent Serenity. The link inside is distorting. The teleportation out is not reliable. The digitization shield and the watchtower's own attempts are conflicting with the signal. Do not try to teleport out. I repeat. Oh, man. I've read about you online. Let's see if your powers can beat what the Exobytes gave me! Here. What a shame. That malfunctioning passkey was attuned to restricted areas. It's Oracle. That shield generator is broken beyond repair. The damage seems recent, too. I'm not sure I should forgive you, Superman. I'm the one who broke the story about you in the Daily Planet. I even gave you your name. And you give your first interview to that, that. It's Oracle. Before it was torn in two, it looks like that band was configured to access the dungeon jail cells. Daily Planet Archive. Comfortable in your kryptonite cage, Superman? No? Good. I'd hate to think you were enjoying hearing that I, Lex Luthor, will now take my rightful place as the ultimate savior of this planet. Once I crack the secrets of the Exobites, I will defeat Brainiac, and then no one will stand in my way. Oh, look, the cavalry has arrived such as it is. This will be quick. If my suit can defeat Superman, just think what it can do to you. than Superman. See, I'll have to take you seriously. Command override. Maximum power suit sequence activate. See, I'll have to take you seriously. Command override. Maximum power suit sequence activate. No! Your power! Too much for me! How? I am Lex Luthor! Yes! Take that, calculator! I'm back online for the moment!
Oh no, get Superman out of that kryptonite cage. I'll Somehow teleport I expected you both to the watchtower. Take down Luther. When you get there, let Supergirl know Superman's DNA alive. Code. She's been ringing my end, ear off this entire falls time. Back on kryptonite. I'm here with an offering from Argus. We've optimized gear that'll help you take on even bigger threats when you're on duty. I am Superman. I was born on the planet Krypton and sent here to Earth to save my life. Use my powers to protect this planet and all who live here. To challenge selfishness, cruelty, greed. To share my gift and my burden with others who choose this fight. It's good to know that I cannot stand alone. With every villain, there is a hero. But every man can choose to be a Superman. Each wing in the Watchtower has its own bank. Wayne Enterprises, Queen Industries, and others all contribute to a fund that rewards heroic activity and provides this secure storage for your gear. I can't believe how evil Lex Luthor is! I should be used to it by now, but I just can't. Superman will need some time to recover from that kryptonite. Thank you so much! I knew you could do it! I had a feeling the moment you first trashed that Brainiac ship that you'd be a power for good. The Justice League wants to say thanks. In fact, your mentor wants to thank you personally.
Usually, Argus isn't too keen on free agents, but I am. This gear will do good work in your hands. Every piece of gear has an item level. The higher, the better. Hey, you look ready to go. Open up that on-duty menu to either jump. Not everyone has what it takes to take a beating from the villains of this world and just keep fighting. But you do. And you've brought the fight right back to them. From all of us in the Justice League, congratulations and thanks. You are now an official member of the JLA. You're a full-fledged member of the Justice League. Congratulations.
Hello? Is anyone there? Hey, over here! You gotta break us out! There's something loose in here! Break through the wall and get us out! No! They're clawing their way through! Ugh! Get it off me! Get it off me! Bastet, a favorite of mine, and late- Just what I wanted, a cat's paw. Lend me a hand and fetch the cat's eye diamonds from the jealous kitties guarding them in these chambers. These relics are turning ordinary people into cats, and unless you want Gotham becoming a wild kingdom, we'd better get their eyes back in place. Museum Archive Notes. Our lion mane totem was found in a Precambrian dig site in Mesopotamia. However, it is clearly not Mesopotamian. Its radiation signature is definitely from off-world. I acquired this during a trip to Peru, trying to save jaguars from stag industry sponsored murder. They won't forget these claws anytime soon.
The hunt is on! Feeding time! Meats, back on the menu! Feeding time! I will die on your flag! This ceremonial mask is the only one in existence. Falconium cell phone this before it's settled in my paws.
Hey, you gonna get rid of these cat people so I can finish fixing this pipe? You, you gotta go in and turn off four valves along the way to, to open up the gate at the end. But um, don't don't breathe too deep. The place is full of fumes.
Batman almost stopped me from stealing this tiger scroll in Hong Kong. Almost. <laughs> oh, I love games of cat and mouse, especially when the bat is involved. This lynx claw is a priceless Native American relic. The man who owned it is a distant memory, but this pretty thing will be mine forever. Museum archive notes. The so-called tiger eye totem is made of a mysterious material that melted my equipment. Do not place this on display until we can consult with Jason Blood or another occult expert.
Museum archive notes. A strange power radiates from the Cheetah Claw totem. There's a mysterious message on its base. Something about, let's see, a wish. Or maybe a curse. More research is required. I wish I could have seen the penguin's face when he discovered this central piece of his smuggled collection of Babylonian artifacts had gone missing. Something this rare belongs to a person who can appreciate it. Me. That deserves a little reward. The final piece. Perfect. Now let's see what power these relics possess. You wish to control us. Now we shall control you! You sought to make us submit! Now you will submit to us! You cannot destroy what has been unleashed! The stealth of the panther invades your being! Hunt your prey! Behave yourself! Might. Show your might! 
Play nice. You dare to destroy our ancient might? The power of the lie transforms you. Show your mind. <laughs> Destroy our ancient might? Foolish mortal, you shall not possess our power. Instead, we shall possess you. You shall be our vessel as we have Don't touch a lady now. Those alien creeps possessed me. Oh! Well, they're gone now. And the diamonds, too, hmm? A pity. When next we meet, I'll have to remember I owe you at least one of my nine lives. The Gotham Museum. All this money spent on security. <laughs> I do love a challenge, and I do love shiny things, especially if they belong to someone else. Jewels, trinkets, gems, treasure beyond compare. But somehow, they never fill the hole in my heart. So I found a mission, a crusade, my little secret. Or at least, it started that way. Now it's the world's most fabulous game of cat and flying mouse! I wonder who is really chasing who. I am the world... I've truly stolen his heart. It went that well, huh? I guess if you ever have bad luck, you can always blame the gear. And don't forget to keep it repaired. Of course you... It went that well, huh? I guess if you ever have bad luck, you can always blame the gear. And don't forget to keep it repaired. Of course you know that. Oh, when you outpace Argus, give that guy Tempest Fuginata a shout. He's a big, friendly guy. Just. I guess don't forget us, okay? Several important events demand your attention. Please check... Several important events demand your attention. Please check in aboard the House of Legends at your earliest opportunity. Have you been? All right, all right, I'll cut the chumminess. I know we don't have much history together, but together we could make history. And speaking of history, I'm in the business of collecting things. Old things, new things, sometimes blue things, but most importantly, things with power. Ah, I got your attention. Good. Meet me at this secret location and I'll give you the details of this little arrangement.
Compromised security of the safe houses has created a dangerous powder keg. Grodd and his cronies are exploiting the situation and stealing everything from experimental tech to sensitive data. We've got to stop them before he can secure an arsenal substantial enough to make the entire city go ape. has a cache of stolen Graviton tech in this nightclub. Can't leave anything that dangerous in their control. Find the Singularity capsules and get them out of there. Don't mess with me! No! Why don't you cool off? Ugh, cold feet? 
You tracked down all the Graviton tech in there. Time to... Wait! Grodd just arrived. You should say hello on your way out. I will pound you for that! Oh. Your end will not be painless! Insolent fool! That won't stop me! plans for the moment, though I doubt they had all of their eggs in one basket. 
Be ready to take back anything Grodd gets his paws on. Let's not waste any time. Get out of there before the place is swarming. There's plenty of contraband we need to recover in other stash houses. Missions are available. This is Lantern Jordan. A war of light has begun, and the Green Lantern Corps needs your help. Travel to Mogo. He's a sentient planet in orbit around Earth. Don't worry, he's on our side. He's a full-fledged member of the Corps. Meow.
It's Oracle. Something crazy's going down, and I think you're the one to restore order. We're talking some serious weird, and it's happening every day. Up for it? Because we could sure use you. what I call a nice clean job. I love when there's no paperwork to fill out. <laughs> That's another computer joke. Okay, fine, one day I'll come up with a funny one. It's Oracle. Something crazy's going down, and I think you're the one to restore order. We're talking some serious weird, and it's happening every day. Up for it? Because we could sure use you.
That's what I call a nice, clean job. I love when there's no paperwork to fill out. <laughs> That's another computer joke. Okay, fine. One day I'll come up with a funny one. It's Oracle. Something crazy's going down, and I think you're the one to restore order. We're talking some serious weird, and it's happening every day. Up for it? Because we could sure use you. Now that's what I call a nice, clean job. I love when there's no paperwork to fill out. <laughs> That's another computer joke. Okay, fine, one day I'll come up with a funny one. Now that's what I call a nice, clean job. I love when there's no paperwork to fill out. <laughs> that's another computer joke. Okay, fine, one day I'll come up with a funny one. Most of the scientists here mean well, but they're not properly equipped to handle the emotional spectrum. Return to base, and use the teleporter to meet Lantern Rainer inside Star Labs. We're going to have to convince them to turn over the mist they've collected. Green Lantern's light! Thank you. 
Try this on for size. Damaged. Get a load of this. My power rings are depleted. But the cyborg remains. What? Oh. Your shield is renewed. Sorry, this won't end well for you. I've mastered the light. What? Didn't hurt. I've had worse. Yeah, I don't think so. Henshaw, by the authority of the Guardians, you're under arrest. Coming here is the last mistake you will ever make. You cannot stop me, Rainer. The Amber Mist. Give it to me, or I will give you the gift of death. Okay, I hear what you're saying. But what if, instead, my friends and I stuff you into the nearest recycling bin? <laughs> Burns bright. No, you don't. This on for size. Pain is nothing.
Get a load of this! Green Lantern's light. Henshaw, by the authority of the Guardians, you're under arrest. Lantern Raider. Coming here is the last mistake you'll ever make. You cannot stop me, Raider. The Amber Mist. Give it to me, or I will give you the gift of death. Okay, I hear what you're saying, but what if instead my friends and I stuff you into the nearest recycling bin? Ugh. Pain is nothing. I've mastered the light. I've had worse. You're through. No, you don't. I will shield you. Hurry up and do not fail me. Light. I am unbeating. Didn't hurt. I don't think so. Pain is never. Hope burns bright. I've mastered the light.
I've had worse. What? <laughs> no, you don't. No, you don't! What? Henshaw, by the authority of the Guardians, you're under arrest. Lantern Ranger, coming here is the last mistake you'll ever make. Huh. You cannot stop me, Rainer. The Amber Mist. Give it to me, or I will give you the gift of death. Okay, I hear what you're saying. But what if, instead, my friends and I stuff you into the nearest recycling bin? Get a load of this! I've mastered the light! I speak for the entire galaxy when I say I'm glad you're on our side. Stay frosty, though. I'm sure they haven't given up for good. Yes, Lantern Rainer, I've completed my analysis of the mist. Hit me with it, Mogo. There is evidence that the mist has a consciousness. I sense a strong will within the Emerald Mist particularly. Is there anything we can do for these living mists? Unless we can obtain more samples of the mists, I do not know. Whatever the case may be, we must keep them out of Sinestro's hands. 
I hear you. We'll do our best. This is Lantern Jordan. A war of light has begun, and the Green Lantern Corps needs your help. Travel to Mogo. He's a sentient planet in orbit around Earth. Don't worry, he's on our side. He's a full-fledged member of the Corps. Generating additional pod munitions. Oh, it's you! I'm glad you're helping us with the war effort. Gives a guy hope. When you're done with my task, let me know. I've got more work for you. You and me, we got this. Right, friend? What's the difference between Kilowog and a 10-ton light construct? About three pounds. <laughs> Don't tell him I said that. Be cautious of messages from... Honestly, I didn't think programming wisecracks would be so difficult. Hey, it's Green Lantern. Remember those mists in Metropolis? Well, Mogo's been working through the data, and you're not going to believe this. The mists are Ion and Parallax, and every other emotional entity. They were nearly destroyed, but we've collected enough to cultivate the spark of their essence. While we're working on that, I'd like you to report to Officer Elza at our outpost in Metropolis. I'll get back to you. This is Hal Jordan. Oa has been invaded by Black Lanterns. I need immediate assistance from anyone who gets this message.
tamper with the emotional spectrum at Star Labs, he endangered the entire universe. It resulted in the entities being blasted into missing little bits. When we put them back together in the power batteries, I think something else came back with them. It's no use. We need help. You have to find a member of the Indigo tribe and bring them here.
If the Black has reached Oa, we're going to need help from the other cores, but we cannot leave Metropolis in its current state. Help thin out the Black Lanterns here, and maybe then we can take allies to Oa. Return to me when you are done with this task. It seems that the Indigo tribe's entity wasn't spared after all. And the entry of Indigo 1 and Monk in this war means one thing. The Black has crawled its way back into our universe. That anti? Well, it just got us. So we better get ready. This won't be easy. Don't tell Sinestro that I was defeated. If the Black really has returned to the universe, it's more than just a few of the cores can handle. We'll have to get everyone on board to fight Necron. I'm really not looking forward to convincing Lara Fleas and Atrocitus. I better pack my plasma proof umbrella. Thanks for the backup. By Sinestro's might. You help me, I help you. Thanks to you, they are able to spare reinforcements. Speak with me again when you're ready, and I'll teleport us.
We must make haste. I will need to get to the central power battery quickly. These lanterns will stay here and hold this point. find regret. Was there? Oh man, you hit harder than kilowatts. Welcome back, Hal Jordan. I will attempt to cleanse the battery. However, I sense it.
I'm glad we were able to get Carol back on our side. She's been looking into the mist and its properties. She's on her way to Ferris Air to recover some of the data from their joint venture with Star Labs. I hope she finds something good. This is Lantern Jordan. A war of light has begun, and the Green Lantern Corps needs your help. Travel to Mogo. He's a sentient planet in orbit around Earth. Don't worry, he's on our side. He's a full-fledged member of the Corps. This is Lantern Jordan. A war of light has begun, and the Green Lantern Corps needs your help. Travel to Mogo. He's a sentient planet This is Lantern Jordan. A war of light has begun, and the Green Lantern Corps needs your help. Travel to Mogo. He's a sentient planet in orbit around Earth. Don't worry, he's on our side. He's a full-fledged member of the Corps. I am certain that my mother would never wage such an unjust war. And yet Circe is not to blame. Since mother has retreated into the palace, all we can do is prepare for her next move. Gather your strength, my friend. You fought many battles in an effort to restore peace. And for that, I will always be grateful. The balance between chaos and order is threatened. You have been called upon to help restore it. I have granted you three tasks to begin your journey. Help me restore the light.
We serve the edicts of great beings.
Can you believe the nerve of Typhon, thinking we'll just sit back and let his monsters take over? Typhon's monsters are holing up in various places from. across Gotham City. Find Onlookers trying to get a sneak peek at Typhon's us. monsters are getting more than they bargained for. Gorgons are turning them all to stone. Take care of Typhon's Gorgons in Gotham City.
Thank you for your help. Knowing how curious people are, I'm sure Thanks for clearing those monsters out. Soon. They've Check proven back. to be persistent. Check back later. There may be more places that need clearing. Hey there, old friend. Or is it new friend? Look, the damn time stream is so wonky at the moment, I don't know whether I'm coming or going. I need your help. Her Degaton, a time-traveling, goofy-haired, fascist wannabe with major insecurity issues, 
has managed to do something horrible to the very fabric of space and time. Exactly what? No bloody clue yet. But I'm working on it. In the meantime, I need you to head to Area 51 and meet up with Special Agent Anderson. She could use your help. There are some disturbing things going on there at the moment. We need your help protecting this here castle or keep or whatever the heck they call it. Support our troops by protecting our immediate perimeter. I know what you must be thinking. How'd this blondie with great gams end up in a war-ravaged village in the middle of WWII? First of all, get your eyes up here, or I'll suck you one. And second, it wasn't an easy trip, but I'm right where I belong. I'm called Lady Blackhawk, but my real name is Zinda Blake. A bunch of years ago, I made it my sole purpose to be the first female member of the legendary fighter squadron, the Blackhawks. And by golly, I did just that. I taught myself how to fly, how to fight, and how to be the fiercest broad this side of the Rhine. As luck would have it, I got my chance to prove myself by actually rescuing the Blackhawks from danger not once, but twice. After that, they pretty much had to let me join. I need supplies over here. You're a champ. My weapon is jammed. I'm out of ammo here. Time to take them. Can I get a resupply? Thanks, buddy. It's go time. Halt! I will tear you apart. These battle reports say you're saving allied lives. Good job. Hey there, old friend. Or is it new friend? Look, the damn time stream is so wonky at the moment, I don't know whether I'm coming or going. I. Hey there, old friend. Or is it new friend? Look, the damn time stream is so wonky at the moment, I don't know whether I'm coming or going. I need your help. Her Degaton, a time-traveling, goofy-haired, fascist wannabe with major insecurity issues, has managed to do something horrible to the very fabric of space and time. Exactly what? No bloody clue yet. But I'm working on it. In the meantime, I need you to head to Area 51 and meet up with Special Agent Anderson. She could use your help. There are some disturbing things going on there at the moment. Hey there, old friend. Or is it new friend? Look, the damn time stream is so wonky at the moment, I don't know whether I'm coming or going. I need your help. Her Degaton, a time-traveling, goofy-haired, fascist wannabe with major insecurity issues, 
has managed to do something horrible to the very fabric of space and time. Exactly what? No bloody clue yet. But I'm working on it. In the meantime, I need you to head to Area 51 and... I specialize in cleaning up messes that others cannot. This is one of the biggest I've ever seen. Say, kid, you and sort of I've look like a, a familiar drink of water. In order to get this under have control, we met before? I need the best hmm. assets I can find. Well, we'll have to chew the fat about that later on. Standards. Right now we have a job to do, so let's get to it. These are Baron von Savage's troops. Can't believe I'm standing back in, in the future. They were no joke. Again, like After the Allies broke Ma. through the German defenses at the Battle of the Bulge, Savage's forces just sort of disappeared, as did he. I'll tell you this, they never had weaponry this advanced. It would have been a game changer. Hey there, old friend. Or is it new friend? Look, the damn time stream is so wonky at the moment, I don't know whether I'm coming or going. I need your help. Her Degato, a time-traveling, goofy-haired, fascist wannabe with major insecurity issues, has managed to do something horrible to the very fabric of space and time. Exactly what? No bloody clue yet. But I'm working on it. In the meantime, I need you to head to Area 51 and meet up with Special Agent Anderson. She could use your help. There are some disturbing things going on there at the moment. I had to do something I never thought I would. I had to seek help from a person I despise. Oh, come now, Rip. You know you've been dying to work for me for ages. I am not working for you, Vandal. With you, perhaps, which is bad enough. Vandal can provide invaluable insight into his past self. Baron von Savage. Baron? Really? Does Archduke take Persuade my past self to help him as Cloud. I've shown what happened during the war. I have a vested interest in things happening exactly as they did. It looks like somewhere in Europe, post D Day 1944, you need to contact the head of the Allied forces entrenched in this besieged village and see how you can help. Our goal is to stop Baron von Savage and her Degator from changing the history of World War II.
Time is relative. Albert Einstein. Time is a pain in my arse. Me, Rip Hunter. Something big is about to happen, or has happened, and I'm just now finding out about it. My sensors in the time sphere started going crazy, which measured the end of area. The next thing I know, the world will have to prepare a storm. Pouring out of tears in time. Paradox energy is off the charts, and it looks like the entire space time continuum is starting to collapse in our set. And a day. only have meaning as savage oh. soldiers. Victory at any cost. is nothing. Excellent work, and I don't give out praise easily, just ask Warrant Officer Jones. At this rate, you'll become a serious contender for a permanent position with my government organization.
Well, hey there, kid. Lady Blackhawk is the name, and sucking fascist right in the kisser is my game. Nice to meet you. Me and my fellow Blackhawks decided to lend a helping hand and fist here. This little village is the last foothold the Allies have on this part of the front. If Von Savage and Per Degaton take this town, there will be no stopping their forces from swarming the rest of Europe. It's been rough going so far, but a Black Hawk never quits, and hopefully neither do you. I had forgotten how well-trained my savage soldiers were. They are putting up a wonderful fight, are they not? I remember that particular village being very important to the Allies and their march toward Axis headquarters. My former stronghold is nearby. I can provide you information on various security weaknesses. I'm almost in place. No one suspects a thing. Step aside, Junior. I will tear you apart. People of this poor village have had it worse than most. Even before the war started, the town was a safe haven for refugees pouring in from Eastern Europe. They thought the medieval walls and that great stone keep would keep them safe, and it sure did for a while. Then Baron von Savage and his shock troopers arrived. Looks like we all made it in unnoticed. Rip said our contact with the JSA is further inside. They'll know where the prisoners are being held. Sivana Lab Notes, August 14, 1944. Today's experiments were a mixed bag. Left with a lot of empty bags of skin. You know, my genius shall figure out a way. Now, now on to subject 27. Sivana. Where is my ultimate soldier? You have had three full years. More than enough time. Given your superior intellect, you were not trolled back through time and given all the resources you could imagine so that you could repeat. Your fascism will spread no further. Hera, give me strength. By the sword of Athena. Mother? Mother? You wear the clothes of an Amazon, yet I do not recognize you as one of my sisters. I would normally demand an explanation, but right now I need allies to defeat this evil. Shields are electrically powered. If we can overload these generators, we could I use them as a the weapon. Fury of the Amazon. Now, you'll pay. Queen Hippolyta, let me explain. The tears in time have allowed me to come here. In my world, you are my mother, and I am Wonder Woman. My daughter, Wonder Woman. Why the gods have... Never mind. These questions must wait. We haven't the time to idle. Baron Von Savage and that loud-mouthed, self-aggrandizing lunatic, Berdegaton, will be aware of our presence soon. 
The fate of the JSA and very world is at stake. The Blackhawks sent a message that the Ultra-Humanite is conducting experiments here, and I fear the worst. Look like we'll be able to force our way through. There's always another way. Let Athena's wisdom guide us. Devana Lab Note, August 26, 1944. As you can see, Baron Savage, we now have a viable subject who has successfully accepted these cybernetic enhancements without crashing the system. Die after drawing his first breath. Bravo. Why isn't it on fire yet? Go in perpetual flame. A walking cybernetic torch of terror. Tired of you. But I... Right away. I want him on fire. <laughs> Athena, forgive them. Now then, let's see how we can resolve this. must not let Ultra-Humanite's experiments continue. Yes. See if those control panels stop the flow of energy. It doesn't look like they shut off completely. At the very least, we can direct the energy somewhere else. That damn dirty pomp is too smart for his own good ape is lucky you guys got to him before I did. He'd be hard pressed to chew even mashed bananas. By Fanagar's moon, there are two of you? Huh. These are strange and dangerous times, but I won't look a gift horse in the mouth. Having another Wonder Woman on our side can only be a blessing. Thank you for freeing us. Polly, I know you must be worried that Wildcat is not in the cells with the rest of us. I fear Dr. Savannah has taken him into his makeshift laboratory. There may still be time to save him, Wonder Woman. Or, I guess I should say Wonder Women. You have been through quite the ordeal and are in no shape to fight. Go, secure us an exit. We'll go. We aren't in any condition to take on Savannah's experiments. Fight fiercely, and we'll see you when you are victorious. Destroy them. That is no good. I will tear you apart. By the gods, Savannah, you had best hope he is not permanently harmed. Release him. Now. You aren't a match for one, let alone two Wonder Women of Themyscira. <laughs> two or 
20. It doesn't matter how many women of wonder you bring, Themyscarian or not, my glorious new experiments will destroy you. Let's see how you fare against my latest creation, a marvel of future science molded by my incomparable genius. You dare strike at me? Is it over? I was about to break free and pummel the good doctor into a genius bag of broken bones. But thanks for the rescue, Polly. I wouldn't have come to save your scruffy behind if you weren't constantly flying off into danger, half cocked with more fists than brains. And I don't know how many times I have to tell you, don't call me Polly. Ah, heck. You know me, Polly. Always causing trouble. Now who's the doppelganger here? Well, well, well. What a touching moment. But you must know by now that I, Perdegaton, can see your every move. I am time's master, and I will soon master the world and all those who inhabit it. Including the high and mighty Justice Society of America. May I suggest you surrender now? I control all the outcomes, and I will take infinite and violent enjoyment out of crushing the insufferable JSA once and for all. He really does like to hear himself talk. I'd like to show him how we deal with evil in my time, but for now, we must go. I find it hard to believe I was so easily swayed by Perdegaton's obviously false charisma. Perhaps it was I who was using him all along. Hippolyta is a 1940s Wonder Woman fighting with the JSA. Never seen that before, but very glad I did. The time stream is completely jacked up. My mind is clearer now as my memories fade. The man I was is slowly slipping away like a dream just after waking. I know I was Johann Waldvogel. A lieutenant in Baron von Savage's cadre of savage soldiers. I wanted to bring order to a chaotic world. Peace through force. I am fire. Hippolyta is a 1940s Wonder Woman fighting with the JSA. Never seen that before, but very glad I did. The time stream is completely jacked up. We are running out of, well, time. Lady Blackhawk needs your help again. Find her in the makeshift command center set up in the old keep inside the village walls. Hippolyta is a 1940s Wonder Woman fighting with the JSA. Never seen that before, but very glad I did. The time stream is completely jacked up. We are running out of, well, time. Lady Blackhawk needs your help again. Find her in the makeshift command center set up in the old keep inside the village walls.
To victory! Can you miss me? We've done a great job defending the stronghold, but we have a new threat upon us we've been unable to stop. A new enemy soldier threatens us. We must find a way to defeat him or all is lost. I was born in a small town right near where Austria, Hungary, and Czechoslovakia meet. We lived on the Austrian side of the border. I had Romani cousins, twice removed, according to my father, who would visit during the summer. They would spin tales of strange supernatural creatures that roamed the countryside at night. I laughed at them for being foolish country folk ruled by superstition. Looks like they're having the last laugh today. I have discovered that this ultimate soldier is a product of stolen technology and ancient magic. Perdegaton has sent forces to a parallel timeline to steal weapons and to this universe's Nanda Parbat to gain access to the rejuvenating waters of the Lazarus Pit. You will regret it. I will tear you apart. That is the... Again. The wall exploded inward, 
and what I can only call a behemoth of patchwork human cars burst through. I ran into the night, and the house followed me up towards me. Of all the terrifying sights I could have that night, what scared me the most? They were wearing uniforms, like some sort of creature commando. The howls, I can still hear them, like my cousin's laughter. Our outpost was well fortified, our back against a sheer rock face, all points on ingress covered by criss-crossing lines of machine gun fire. And we believed we ourselves for these all days. eternity. And we were, until that night, the night the creatures came. First, there was a howl, like a lone wolf. But different. Then Heinrich thought he saw a bat flying into the barracks. Finally, an inhuman roar came from the other side of the wall. Then, little hell. A man wolf, the only way I can describe the creature, leapt over the fence and began tearing into men like tissue paper. That was not the end of our terror that night. His connection to those places has made him practically unstoppable. In order to defeat him, you will need to travel even further back in time and prevent my soldiers from obtaining their prize from the respective timelines. You will regret that. Normally, your uninvited presence here in Nanda Parbat would be a death sentence. But this is not normal and Ra's al Ghul is in need of your assistance. We are overrun by enemies wielding weapons for which we have no defense. My assassins have been slaughtered. The foul interlopers have taken control of the Lazarus Pit. We must take Nanda Parbat back! We 
you Fernanda Parbat You oppose me. Not bad. Stand down or die. Swat at the air all you want. you.
Ignorance is punishable by death. I'd reconsider. You'll never get the best of me. Grunty, head back! I shall rebuild the League with the aid of the Lazarus Pit, for which I have you to thank. You have the gratitude of the Demon's Head. However, if you enter Nanda Parbat uninvited again, I will not be so accomplished. We are stronger! <laughs> By the gods, yet another Wonder Woman. I am Hippolyta, queen of the Amazons. I am from a different universe, one where Savage has joined forces with a time-traveling neo-fascist from the future named Perdegaton. He's given Savage the weapons to rule the world. Not on my watch. In my world, we've beaten back the Axis forces months ago. 
and I won't allow these savage soldiers to get their hands on any of these devices. You will regret it. That is nothing. We may be Amazon. We are seven, stronger. But I see we both fight the fury of Athena in our hearts. I will tear yes. you apart. If only my mother would join the fight. That would be a sight to behold. We are stronger. That is not. I will break you. She is indeed lucky to have a daughter as fierce as you, and one committed to ridding the world. Incoming! If only she saw it that way. That but it has been a sight to see you here in battle alongside me. Oh. Oh. Hera! Give us strength. Let me introduce you to the afterlife. Dare strike at me? <clears throat> Fiddlesticks! <laughs> Jim Craddock, at your service. Oh. Bro. 
rubbish. Oh! <laughs> oh! In the name of Gaia! Bloody hell! You will fall! Blast! <laughs> It is not lost on me that in a battle for time itself, there is precious little of it to spend getting to know those I fight alongside. But we must finish this fight before it is too late. I do see my mother in you after all. The fates brought us together this day. Perhaps they shall do it again in the future. Perhaps they shall. Goodbye, Diana, daughter of Themyscira. May the gods watch over you. You'll pay for that.
will fall. with the fury of the Amazon. By Athena's favor, the monstrosity has been defeated and the village saved. Severing his connection to the timelines was the key. And you? You are nearly as fierce as an Amazon. Time travel within time travel to disrupt alternate time streams in alternate universes? Nice work. It's like a Russian nesting doll of paradoxes, none of which are good for the stability of the space-time continuum. To add insult to injury, Per Degaton is still jumping to the present day with Von Savage's soldiers to steal technology and weapons. Until we can figure out how to put a stop to his plans in the past, we need to... Me and my platoon had gotten separated from the battalion and fell behind. We had to hole up in this little blown-to-hell town for the night. No, 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 listen to me. I'm not kidding. I swear to Patton himself, I seen it with my own two eyes. Friggin' thing must have been three stories tall and had machine guns and mortars poking time out of it every which way like some travel, kind of giant metal porcupine. Time it sounded like a tornado made of wood. Then it nice rolled work. through the town and off into the... Time travel within time travel to disrupt alternate time streams in alternate universes? 
Nice work. It's like a Russian nesting doll of paradoxes, none of which are good for the stability of the space-time continuum. To add insult to injury, Per Degaton is still jumping to the present day with Von Savage's soldiers to steal technology and weapons. Until we can figure out how to put a stop to his plans in the past, we need to stem the flow of future tech to his forces. As much as it irks me... As much as it irks me, I must agree. The past has played out exactly how I wish it to. The power of the West that grew after World War II is integral to... Well, let's just say I have a vested interest in our current socio-political climate. All of which stems from the outcome of that conflict. You must stop Degaton wherever and whenever you can. He's been tracked to a warehouse in Gotham. I suggest you start there. Well, hello there.
I know that when time travel is involved, it's weird to say... Bollocks! Do I look like your mum? What are you going on about? Bloody heroes. Bloody villains. I think Brainiac is doing us all a favor by thinning the herd. Come, come. One must always look their best.
These styles shall serve you much better than their uh, previous owners. to low society and high standards of fashion. All right. Ranks is a planet-sized city with planet-sized weapons. He's got an enormous light railgun that can really do some damage. We must launch an assault on Ranks and stop the light railgun from firing. This will require gaining access to the weapons array system. Assaulting Ranks won't be easy. There's certain to be a large number of Sinestro Corps members stationed there. I'm detecting interference with the teleporters. I am unable to bring them offline. They're being rerouted. Enemies incoming. It looks like the attack on ranks is on hold. Prepare to defend Mogo. It's the Red Lantern Corps. They've hijacked the teleporters. I am unable to shut down the teleporters. You will need to disable them manually. There is no other option. Get to the...
teleporters have been corrupted. Return to the core chamber. We have more attackers in there. going to win this weaklings I will rip you apart I'll hurt you for that
My divinations against Hecate are nearly complete. The Joker and the Riddler have not been on best terms since the Clown Prince of Crime hired Deathstroke to take Riddler out. Lucky for the Riddler, a hero was there to save him. Then he went underground. Seems as though he wasn't just hiding. He's made a move. A big one. On the amusement mile. I guess he took that assassination attempt personally. Speaking of taking things personally, Batman is missing. Batwoman didn't want to tell you that for risk of the word spreading, but I need you to keep an ear to the ground. With Batman out of the picture, we've got to get creative. Batwoman and I have an idea. We're going to throw a match on this powder keg and hope it'll burn up quick without any innocent people getting hurt. It's not like Batman to go radio silent for this long. One of these thugs must know something. These damn Don't hired go easy goons. on them. We They're putting too to many cops Batman. in the hospital. I need your take help care to get both them. sides Capiche? of this gang war against each other. Pretend to take a side, work against the other, and leave yeah. them closer to the I don't have a big heart when it comes to scum like these guys. The boss wants arrests, but I just want to put This gang war situation is getting out of hand. Our guys are getting hit from both sides, and we're having trouble maintaining the peace. We could use a hand. You in? Why, Nightwing? That sounds like an idea an Al Ghul would come up with. Perhaps my son is rubbing off on you. With my beloved missing, Gotham is at its weakest. And I won't allow these psychopath gang lords to go off book and plan their own little war. The society won't allow it. If I or my men can assist, let me know. Working with the League of Assassins in this case is for the best. The Joker's thugs have some interesting toys at their disposal. If we're to win this gang war, we need to I use our own weapons against them. I don't care who you work them. for. What I do care about is the Riddler. He's nowhere to be found. But if I know him, as I do, he's a... You're unquestionably mine. That wasn't funny. What the? You've got a
All right. Ranks is a planet-sized city with planet-sized weapons. He's got an enormous light railgun that can really do some damage. We must launch an assault on Ranks and stop the light railgun from firing. This will require gaining access to the weapons array system. Assaulting Ranks won't be easy. There's certain to be a large number of Sinestro Corps members stationed there. How? I'm detecting interference with the teleporters. I am unable to bring them offline. They're being rerouted. Enemies incoming. It looks like the attack on Ranks is on hold. Prepare to defend Mogo. It's the Red Lantern Corps. They've hijacked the teleporters. I am unable to shut down the teleporters. You will need to disable them manually. There is no other option. Get to the teleportation chambers and destroy their connections before we're overrun. Going to win this. Weaklings, I will rip you up. You're so slow. You fool. Starro, I have come to conquer. Glad you were here. We might not have held the line without your help. This is the opportunity we've been waiting for. You're right, Mogo. We'll split up into two teams. Ground Squad, you'll head to Metropolis and use the Star Lab's equipment to infuse yourselves with the Amber Mist that they do collected. nicely. The Amber Mist's properties should allow you to bypass ranks of security and gain access to the weapons facilities. Assault Squad will head directly to ranks and begin to press towards the security center. I am sorry. It will need to activate I a teleporter inside to ranks conquer. to enable the Ground Squad's arrival from Metropolis. Let's go. There's no time to waste.
enemy intruders detected. All core members reported. Attacking personnel in teleporter control. <gasps> requesting reinforcements. With the teleporter activated, the ground squad will be able to meet up with you once they finish their task in Metropolis. Get to the main security chamber and wait for them. Forces entering the security station, activating security construct. Soon, you will learn true terror.
security construct has been lost. Access denied. Dispatching security patrols. Access denied. Dispatching security patrols. Now that the ground squad is infused with the Amber Mist, you should be able to confuse ranks as sensors and bypass the security lock. Good luck. Access granted to core chambers. Ranks knows something's up. He's activated a series of security protocols up ahead. Some of you will need to stay in the security room and use the override terminals to guide the rest of the group through the area affected by the lockdown. Once through, they should be able to bring the security measures offline and disarm the path for the rest of the team. Once inside, you can hack the weapons array teleporters and we'll join you. Organization in progress. Protein, you will do nicely. I am sorry. Constructing the reorganization in progress. I am sorry. I have come to harm 
Structural reorganization in progress. in progress. Structural reorganization in progress. Construct room reorganization in progress. Construct room reorganization in progress. 
Structural reorganization in progress. in progress. Construct room reorganization in progress. Construct room reorganization in progress. Construct room reorganization in progress.
Thank you. 